Okay, so many of you have been asking, how do I speed up my computer? How do I get this thing to go faster? It's not running like it used to when I first bought it. Uh, maybe you're turning your computer on and it takes forever for it to boot. It never just wants to load. Uh, you try to access certain programs and it just seems like it'll just never go. Uh, maybe you're getting error messages or your computer's freezing and you're just wondering what's going on with my computer. How can I get it to go faster and, and, and fix what's what's going on with it? Well, I want to talk to you about a program today that I recently downloaded and I did purchase this product. It's called Speedy PC Pro and you can actually go to speedypcpro.org and you can get more information about it. You can see that they are partnered with uh, Microsoft and the Better Business Bureau and also Intel. So it's a, uh, you know, this isn't just some uh, cheap software thrown up. It, it works extremely well. And I'm going to go through and show you that here in just a minute. But you can go here to speedypcpro.org. And if you want, as I go through the software, you can also download it right now by just clicking one of these green buttons here. And I think there may be another one here and install it on your computer and you can go through it with me as I go through it and show you everything about how it works and um, and you should notice a huge difference also now what I will tell you is that this tool is free to download it will scan your computer for free it will show you a lot of problems that it can fix with your computer but unless you purchase it you will not be able to fix those errors um, you, like me and probably most others, you've downloaded some kind of free software in hopes that you know it's going to fix all these problems on your computer and make it faster and it doesn't. And that's because you get what you pay for and so I finally decided to invest in Speedy PC Pro. And I'm thankful I did because it did, it made a huge difference uh, to the overall performance of my computer. Just to go over a few things before we jump into software, you can see it fixes system problems to slow the slows the computer it gets rid of active malware um, it uh, deletes junk files it improves your overall speed by removing unwanted resources it cleans out privacy files that are stored on your, on your computer from the internet such as credit card numbers passwords and things you've done online um, it also has a dig for a, a defragmenter which organizes all the files on your computer so it runs faster remove unwanted add-ons to your browser if you haven't done any maintenance on your browsers for a long time you may find out you have a lot of add-ons and a lot of them are ones you do not want on there it may be spyware related uh, add-ons and things just to market products to you and it can really bog down your browsing speed help open file extensions if there are certain files on your computer you don't know how to open um, it's got a little tool that will show you files uh, you can download to open those and you can also manage your restore points. So, um, but I do recommend if you want to go through this with me, and I'll show you exactly how well this works and what it does. But just go to speedypcpro.org and you can click the download button. It only takes a few seconds to download it, and then you can uh, install it and follow along with me. So first, you're going to see the overall or the overview here, and it says it's determined that your computer system is running well and in good shape. And the last scan, um, one fifteen twelve, that was actually this morning. It says there's two problems, but I didn't let the scan run all the way through. I stopped it, and that's why it's saying, you know, everything's in good shape. So what I want to do first before I run the full scan is uh, make sure everything's checked here. It's going to check for system problems, malware, um, any ways it can improve performance, um, privacy protection, and also junk files. And I'm going to go ahead and, and start to scan here, and it may take a, a couple minutes to go through. So I'm going to pause it while it goes ahead and finishes. I'm not sure how long it's going to take. Okay, it only took about a minute and it's finished. You can see the results here. Now, if you haven't done any kind of maintenance on your computer since you bought it or for a long time, you're probably going to be in the red on every one of these. You'll probably have a lot of corrections on your computer to do because over time after you after you're surfing online, after you're downloading stuff, uninstalling, and installing, uh, your computer just gets bogged down with different kinds of files and things that you put on your computer. And, and those are kind of things that Speedy PC Pro can remove and uh, fix a lot of system resources in there caused by those um, programs and cause your computer to run a lot faster. You're going to see here there's over 42 megs of just junk files on here that it can get rid of to help improve the speed. And so I'm going to go ahead and click Fix All, and we'll see what happens here. Now, if you um, haven't purchased 
speedy PC Pro, you're not going to be able to uh, fix yours until you do. A little box is going to come up and say register. Now I do recommend that you actually go online to register. If you call, if you make a phone call to register it, you can do it that way, but they're going to try to sell you some other stuff too. So I recommend you just click the little green register button. You go there and register the software. I believe it's like 30 bucks. It's been a while since I've since I paid for this. So I think it's like $30. And um, and then you'll be able to come back and you'll get an email and that email is going to have your license code in it. You're going to put the license code in the software and it will let you correct all those errors on your computer. So now it's telling me to finish cleaning. The system needs to be rebooted but I'm not going to reboot it just yet. So it says Speedy PC Pro determines your system's running well. It cleaned up all the junk files and you can see right now it's running at almost peak performance. So that was uh, super easy to do, to clean up everything on my computer. You know, there's just no human, humanly way possible you could go in there and find all these files yourself and correct them. And it says it's corrected total over uh, 2,616 items. So to do that myself, it would take months to do. And then by that time, there'd be more junk on there. So um, I highly recommend getting a software like, like Speedy PC Pro, even if you don't buy this one. Get one similar. Um, I've downloaded a few of them. This is by far the best one that I've used. Let's go over here. You can see it also creates restore points for you. That way if something does go wrong on your computer, you can just uh, click on one of these, slash restore point, click restore, and it's going to restore your computer back to that point. Uh, there's additional tools on here. This will also help to increase your uh, computer speed. You go to process manager, and it's going to show you everything currently running in the background of your system right now. And it's got little icons um, chart over here showing you whether they're system files, whether you installed them, if they're other files, unwanted files, or if it's malware. So if you see the sign, that's a bad deal right there. But you can see down through here on each file, as you go through it, whether they're good files, bad files, or whatever. And mine looks pretty good right now. Um, performance. This here shows your overall performance of your computer, the usage, and right here is when it done the scan of my computer, and it uses a lot more memory to do that. Startup Manager. This is a big one, and this is what really slows down your computer when you turn it on and it takes forever to load, is usually you'll have a big list of files right here. And what it is, when you download and install new programs, a lot of them want to start as soon as you start your computer. So as your computer is trying to load, all these other files are trying to start up at the same time, bogging it down and causing it to take a long time to start up. So you can go over here and X out a lot of these programs that you see here. And, and what that will do is when next, next time you try to start your computer, it's not going to let those files load, so your computer is going to boot up faster. And we've got File Manager. This was the File Extension Manager. If you have a document, if you have like a PDF file, um, an Adobe document, and, and if you don't know what that is or, or, or if you can't open the file, if you click Find Software, it's going to show you software you can download that will open up that kind of file. And you just click there and you can download it. So that's pretty neat. You can defrag your hard drive here. This can take um, you know anywhere from like 20-30 minutes up to a couple hours depending on the size of your hard drive. But you click Analyze, and it's going to go through, and it's going to show you your hard drive, how organized it is. And if it's not organized, it's going to tell you you need to defrag it. So you click this, and it's going to rearrange everything on your hard drive, put it together neatly so where when you do a search or when you access certain applications, it's going to do it a lot faster. And the Browser Helper Object Manager. Um, these are plugins that get, get installed on your browser. Sometimes... Um, they get installed and you don't know about it. They're unwanted. And if you see any on here, you can just check mark them and disable them. And that will help you improve your browsing uh, on the internet tremendously. And under the settings, you can go through your settings and there's just different options. Um, you can schedule your scans to take place at certain times. Uh, for your registry scan settings, you can check mark what you want to check. I recommend leaving them all. There's privacy settings. This here will show you what uh, privacy files that you want cleaned out when it runs the scan. I recommend leaving all these checked. This will help improve your overall um, computer performance as well as being on the internet. Ignore settings, view and remove ignored items. I don't have anything there. And junk settings. Uh, select the folders and extensions you would like to scan for when performing a junk file scan. Okay, I've never used this yet, but 
Uh, it's there if I do. So overall, um, if you're looking for a way to speed up your computer, I know there's a lot of programs out there that, that say they can help you to speed up your computer. Um, I've downloaded a lot of them. This is one that I know for a fact that does work. Um, not only that, but you know, you can tell from uh, being partnered and being on the Better Business Bureau and being a partner of Microsoft that uh, that this is something that works and it works really, really well. So it's not uh, one of these. It's, it's not a scam product. It's not one of those that you're going to download and it's going to scan your computer and show you a lot of these files that's not really on your computer just to try to get you to buy it. The software doesn't work like that way. It's made by a very reputable company called Perita Logic and uh, they have a variety of software used to help with your computer performance and this is by far one that I highly recommend so if you want to go there and try it out yourself like I said you can download it for free and have it scan your computer to see if it's um, see what it finds on your computer you know at least that way you, you'll know if it's uh, if it's something that you need to buy to help your overall compu uh, speed of your computer but uh, if you want to go there it's uh, www.speedypcpro.org so that's my review on speedy pc pro and i hope it works for you as well as it has for me